Does it even start? I don't even know if it started or not. I don't even need my headset on anymore. There we go. Right, are we, are we, I think we're sorted. I think we're sorted. Nate's helped me out here, so. It's going to be a, a long one, if we're live. I think, I'm pretty sure we're live. I can see it right now. I can see it. So. Right, what up, what's up, Yuki? What's up, Dendor? Right, I'm going to. Quickly just tweet it. My sensitivity on my mouse, I've hit the sensitivity mouse so many times and it's just it's just not working out for me really. I'll be honest. Uh, it is crazy sensitivity and I can't change it back because Synapse sucks. Thanks Razor, appreciate it. I am live. There we go, boys. That's the one. Right. All good to go. Yep. Yeah, thanks, Nate, for the help. Appreciate that. Okay. I don't know what to begin with because Nate's just seen the picture I sent him. Uh, I've got tons of stuff. Also, I'm repping the, uh, I don't know if you can say that, man with the mission, you know, the goat. Um, we'll start off with a series that is not very good. But, you know, the volume looks nice. Eden Zero. Here we go. Um... It's basically fairy tale in space. Same thing, really. I mean, <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna keep up with this. This, by the way, this haul is from basically the end of December all the way till now. So it's just like a few months of collecting. But yeah, Eden Zero is not the greatest thing ever. Um, but the volumes look nice and the spine looks uh, great as well. But other than that, that's the spine's probably the best thing about it. So probably not going to pick up any more, but we'll see. Uh, if it, if I hear it gets better eventually, then maybe I'll get more. But Fairy Tale is boring to me, and this is pretty much the same thing. So yeah, that is that. Uh, we'll go with the thing that's on the floor next because it is a box set, um, and I picked this up beginning of this month, I think. Um, what's up Elon Musk, how you doing? <laughs> but I picked up the first Bleach box set. Um, it is quite insane, actually. Uh, I do like, I do kind of like it. There's the, uh, s the side, the other side, and the, the back, and the front. So, yeah, there's, uh, 21 volumes in this one. It's a lot. <laughs> and to be honest, I can't even fit it on my desk right now. So I'm going to have to move my mic real quick. And then try and get the volumes out. So, yeah. It's going to be this is going to be problematic. Here we go. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. There you go. 21 volumes. I just hit my mic. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so we're going to have to try and get them all out. And I'm going to have to lob them on the floor because I ain't got no room on my desk. Yeah, Ali, I've heard that. I've heard that I only need the first one because it's the best part of it. But, you know, it seems good. I mean, I'm only halfway through the first volume and it's pretty good. So, yeah, we'll see how it goes from there. But there's volume one. I'm just going to have to keep lobbing them on the floor. I've got no room anywhere else. Volume two. Three. Four, five. <laughs> I might have to start doing that soon. Don't you worry about that. Six. The covers of Bleach are quite simple, but they're nice. Uh, I think the later ones look a little bit better than what these ones do, but yeah. Volume seven there. Volume eight. This one's trippy. All the upside down ones are trippy as hell, man. I always like... I'm like that, and it's like, whoops, wrong way. Nine. That's a nice cover. You know why. Anyway. <clears throat> Ten. Eleven. That's a cool one. 
12. Now, actually, I think Viz have, like, screwed me over it because I don't even th I don't even know how Amazon would have done it because, obviously, it was all wrapped up, the box set. And uh, there's volume 13. Uh, yeah, the box set was all wrapped up. And one of them's damaged. Like, someone's put, like, a pencil through them. Like, it, through, like, one part of it. And it's really weird. But there's volume 14. Um, I think it's this one. Yeah, here it is. 50, volume 15. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Like, right there. That. Like, someone's put, like, a pencil through it or something. I, I, I don't know how you even do that. But how can Amazon have damaged that? There's no way. That must have been someone at Fizz or something making it. <laughs> Just put it in the box. That'll do. But, yeah. That's that. <laughs> 16, probably my favourite cover of Bleach so far. There you go. That's a good one. Someone's gonna, I know someone's gonna walk into my room. I swear to God, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> 17. 18. 19. Let me know if the glare is too much and I'll like try and change it. Because I'm not actually like looking directly at it. I'm looking at the delayed stream. So, 20. And finally, 21 that's in the box set. So, just do that. There we go. Right, let me get uh, OBS up real quick. And uh, it also comes with, obviously, little character thing, travel guide thing. And a two-sided poster. Which is quite cool. But yeah. That's all that came in the box set. Cool box set. Uh, we'll probably pick up the Naruto and One Piece ones at some point. But not my biggest concern shall we say. Um, so let's move my mic. And then I'm going to get OBS up so I can see what I'm actually doing as it happens. So yeah. Um, <sighs> next up we have a new... Kind of release, I got this this month. That is Kino's Journey. I did watch the anime for this, a little bit of it. I didn't finish it, but I did enjoy what I watched. So, I picked up the manga, and uh, yeah, I haven't read it yet. So, nothing I can say about that. But uh, I'll do what Nate said. Lob that on my bed. There we go. And then we have The Goat. The Goat right here. Volume 19 of Riku Do. Obviously, you guys know... Picking up the Japanese volumes because obviously we're never going to get it over here. Um, I have no hope that it's going to go come over here, but I have to pick these up because they are some of the best covers you'll ever, ever see. So that's just that. Um, art style is incredible. Uh, I definitely recommend you pick this up. <clears throat> but yeah, next up we have another goat, another goat, Doctor Stone. If you're not reading this, you've got to. It's super good. The anime's coming out soon. The new PV dropped today. That was hype. I am so excited for the anime of this, and I love this series. Uh, art style, incredible by Boichi. And obviously, uh, Inagaki, Richiro Inagaki, who done iShield 21, also worked on this. Great, great stuff, honestly. Dr. Stone, great stuff. So I've got, obviously, Volume 2. And volume three as well. So uh, <laughs> I am. I, I do like calling things the goat because they are great. Um, but I don't have volume four. Volume four came out. Was it yesterday? I think it was yesterday. Something like that. I think it came out yesterday for us in the UK. It's obviously been out for a while in the US, I think. Um, but unfortunately, Amazon are actually stupid. And it comes out and it says it's not being like it's not being delivered till like April. You are having a Scooby-Doo, mate. Honestly. But yeah, that's Dr. Stone. Um, treat that with respect. That's going right there. Uh, next up is... I'm not sure if I've showed this off because I have had it for a while. I don't think I have. So I've got Demon Slayer Volume 1. I know Nate recently picked this up as well. Um, yeah, I... I want to read it soon. I haven't read any of it yet. Um, but I have got it. Nice cover. Uh, the art style isn't my favourite, I wouldn't say, but it's not particularly bad either. Um, but yeah, it looks good, so I'll get into it eventually. So yeah, that's Demon Slayer. 
going to start hopefully once I caught up with physical releases of Yaba. Yeah. Yaba has good covers. Art style is a bit. Eh. We'll see. Um, anyway, next up. <laughs> as soon as he says Yaba, I show it off. But uh, yeah. Next up, we have a series I've wanted to check out the manga for for a while. And I've had volume one. I think I showed volume one off. Uh, in my last haul, or the haul before that, can't remember, um, but that's Dimension W, this is Volume 2, uh, and Volume 3 as well that I've got, um, amazing covers, Dimension W have some of the best covers you'll see, honestly, just so good, uh, I ha I've read the first volume, and it is good, um, but so was the start of the anime, so, it went down here at a certain point, I think around episode 8 or something like that. Um, but, yeah, I wanted to check out the anime. Uh, not the anime, the manga. Uh, so, yeah, got these two covers. They kind of glow in the dark. They're not very powerful glow in the docks, but they kind of do. Um, but, yeah, great release by Empress, honestly. They they look amazing. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to try it. I mean, the spines look nice as well. Unfortunately, this one is uh, a little bit misprinted, but it's not the end of the world. So, yeah. Thanks a lot, Yen Press. Appreciate the misprint. What do they even do when they misprint things? They're like, ah, that'll do. We'll just send it out anyway. Like, <laughs> I don't, I don't understand how it works, but you know, whatever. Uh, next up, I got this for Christmas from my parents, and it is Slam Dunk. Uh, I've heard amazing things about this series. That it's a masterpiece. It's a must read, and I've not read it yet. <laughs> Thanks, Zypha. Appreciate. Appreciate you being the big fan. <laughs> but yeah, there's Slam Dunk. Um, got this for Christmas, as I said. And I'm excited to check it out. So, yeah, I got Volume 1, 2. Covers of this are awesome as well. 3. 4, which is incredible. Like, look at that cover. That is so good. That's amazing, that is. And I got Volume 5 as well. So that's all I got of Slam Dunk. Gonna hopefully pick up. A lot more of the series, hopefully maybe all of it at some point. Um, but that won't be until the future. So, yeah, I'm going to put that down here and hope I don't tread on it later on. Next up, we have a series I don't think a lot of people have heard of. Um, but that is Topu GP. Now, I wanted to get this because I haven't seen like a motorcycle manga or anything. So, I wanted to check it out. And I read the first volume and it is super good, in my opinion. I, I really... I really do enjoy this series. I think it looks awesome. And uh, I'm excited to read the rest of it. I think Volume 4 comes out. Like, they come out really slowly, I think. Uh, it might just be coming out slowly in Japan as well, but I'm not sure. Um, but I think Volume 4 comes out next month, maybe. So I'll definitely be picking that up. So, uh, yeah, definitely recommend it. It's by uh, Kodansha. And they're kind of the same size as Viz Signature Editions, by the way, as well. So just thought I'd let you know. Uh... <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I, I do like it. So I got the first three volumes. So here's volume two and three as well. Nice covers. I mean, it's not like a must-read series, but it's just something I, I enjoy. I, th I think it's pretty good. Um, but yeah. Next up, we have volumes two and three of Arjun. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> of Arjun. Um... I know Nate will be happy with these pickups. I did get these from, from my friend Shaw, uh, who gave me them for my birthday. So, thanks a lot for that. Amazing stuff. Arjun, you already know the greatness. Love this series. And I love, I mean, not particularly this one, but, like, I love the colours later on down the line. Like, the nice neon bright colours that they use for the spines and just the covers in general. So, I'm excited to pick up the rest of the series. Um, definitely love vertical manga. Um, just, I like the size, like the smaller sizes of the volumes, but, uh, yeah, definitely excited to get into more Arjun, so, yeah, that is that. So, volumes two and three, they're going on the bed too. Right, next up we have another more vertical stuff, and that is My Neighbor Seki. Um, I think this is quite underrated as well, I haven't heard many people talk about this series, um, but I've read the first volume... Well, almost the first volume. 
And it is just every chapter is like a different sort of story, but they're obviously in the same place. They're just in school, and this kid here, he doesn't talk at all. He doesn't talk. He just creates these different worlds on his desk, and obviously she is getting distracted in class by his creations on his desk. And it's just a funny series. It's only 10 volumes, so I'm going to pick up the rest of the series soon. But yeah, I definitely recommend this series because it's just a fun series to read. So yeah, that is pretty much that. So I got volumes 1 and 2 um, quite a while ago. I think last month or January, I think one of those two. So yeah, definitely recommend that. I enjoy that a lot. And also I got Flying Witch volumes 1 and 2. Um, just wanted to check out the manga. I didn't watch the anime. I'm not sure if it's, uh, like, the same th Like, if it followed it exactly, I, I have no idea. But I wanted to pick up the manga because I do love the covers of these. Especially, uh, Volume 2. It just looks super, super nice. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's that pretty much. Uh, so Flying Witch. And my name is Seki. My vertical, uh, I think my only vertical stuff this time around. So, yeah. Next up, we have a series that I like, but yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Not even, not even complaining about it. <laughs> I like, I like getting manga, and so I'm gonna spend my money on what I like. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, next up, we have Case Closed, uh, which is a long ass series, and I am not really gonna pick up the rest. I do like it. But I just don't think it's my type of series, per se. I don't know. I, I just don't think it's necessary for me to get the rest of the series. So I might just give this away to one of my friends. Um, but uh, yeah, so Case Closed Volumes 1, 2, and 3 as well that I got there. So yeah, but this is, this as I said, this is a span of like three three months or so of collecting. So yeah. Uh, next up, we have, obviously, a series that's getting an anime this year, I think. And I've read the first volume. I haven't um, got... Uh, what's, what's he said? Collects the whole series. <laughs> well, I, I, I'm one of those people who don't like, you know, just three volumes all the time on the shelf. You know, I, I like getting full, up, full series, you know, like... Um, they don't have to be straight away, but I like getting them as soon as possible. But, yeah, Fire Force, obviously, everyone knows this. Uh, it's getting an anime soon, and the trailers look hype as hell. So, yeah, good series. Good series so far. Uh, so, I've got volume one. Well, I've, I've got the whole series. <laughs> but, yeah, volume one, two. Also, this a lot of this stuff was from Christmas money, so it wasn't actually all my money, okay, and my birthday money as well, so, yeah, <laughs> so volume three, four, <clears throat> five, six, I just love the, like, the covers of these, they, they, they kind of remind me of the days ones, because of the red and the white background, but yeah, there's seven. Uh, I think this is the annoying ass character. I don't, I can't remember exactly, but I mean she's okay, but she has this weird thing going on. I don't, I don't know what they're trying to do with this character, but maybe she gets better later on. I've only read two volumes, so <laughs> uh, volume eight, nine, ten. <clears throat> 11, 12, 13, and 14. So that's all of it. That's the latest volume, obviously. Um, but uh, yeah, picked that up recently. Uh, where do you find the room? Jesus, probably got his stack like... <laughs> nah, man. They, they all fit on my one bookshelf, so... Just saying. <laughs> uh, I do have to double stack a few of them, though, but that's it, really. Um, next up, we'll go... All of these are full series, so... Yeah. 
Yeah, when I was starting to collect Fire Force, it was like, I was like, oh yeah, there's probably like five volumes. Yeah, never mind, there was 13. I was like, oh, Jesus, I thought this was like the, a new R series. I didn't realise there was that many volumes, but apparently there is. So, next up we shall go with a series that I got 10 volumes for free. So that, well, I ordered it. I'm pretty sure, uh, yeah, I ordered it. And then I cancelled the order because I wanted something else. But they accidentally sent me they accidentally sent me ten volumes. So I was like, you know what, screw it, I'm just gonna collect the whole series. Uh, so I got this with all of my birthday money. Um, and it's a series that I've been recommended a lot um, by watching other YouTube videos and things like that. Um, I've watched a lot of manga halls and manga collection videos where they've got this series and they're like you definitely need to read this series. It's such a good series. So I've got Toriko uh, Volumes 1. All these Toriko has such an amazing art style for a shonen. Like, it's got one of the best art styles uh, that I've seen in, like, shonen. But yeah, I definitely am excited to read this. Uh, so there's Volume 1, Volume 2, Volume 3. There's a lot of Toriko Volumes as well. <clears throat> Have you collected JoJo or are you going to soon? I'm going to get JoJo eventually. Uh, I'm probably going to start when part four comes out. Because I, I feel like JoJo is a series that it doesn't really matter what one you start collecting first. So I might get like part four, volume one. And then get like part three first. Just to get the longer ones out of the way. And then go for part one and two or something like that. But we'll see what happens. Um, but yeah, Toriko volume four. Yeah, you can't complain about that. They ain't asked me to send it back, so might as well keep them, you know? <laughs> Volume 5. This is a sick cover, by the way. Toriko has such good covers. Volume 6. Volume 7, which is a really nice one. I, I do like that one a lot. That's a really nice one. Uh, Volume 8. <clears throat> now, I'm just trying to find the room to place all these now, man. I'm running out of room. But you can see there's just... Stacks them. Uh, I probably will. To be fair, uh, I've heard, a, I've seen a lot of your tweets about that. So yeah, uh, volume nine. This is a nice car. I love the ice on this cover. It just looks sick. <coughs> volume ten. Eleven. Has anyone picked that uh, domestic girlfriend series up, or is that still just like up in the air whether someone's going to pick that up or not? 12. My, what happened to your Naruto collection? I haven't stopped. I'm going to get the first box set eventually. I do have the the three in ones, like two of them. That I got in America, like 2016 or whatever it was. Um, but yeah, they freaking suck. So I'm going to get the box set at some point. Uh, he did not um, stray me away from it because... The first part of Naruto, mo uh, most people like the first part of Naruto. It's just Shippuden that doesn't people don't work, uh, don't don't work, don't like. <laughs> but uh, yeah, there's volume thirteen of Toriko. Great cover that one as well with the food there. There's a uh, there's pizza there, so lovely. Gotta love that one. Uh, Fourteen. Let me know what your favorite Toriko cover is when I've showed them all off because they're sick, especially this one. Fifteen, super good. Super good. Crunchy eyes are digitally, but not physically yet. Right, okay. 16. 17. Now, this is... It's hard, man. Toriko has such good covers. But 17, I mean, look at that. That is so good. That is amazing cover, that one. Love that one. 18. <clears throat> 19. 20. Right, let's move that over <laughs> and get the next pile. Because there is 43 volumes in Toroko, so 21, 27, another great cover there. Their necks are like hench as hell, bro. <laughs> Their necks are freaking huge. 28. 29. 
dude, I'll tell you, I'm becoming Christian and just repeating myself. <laughs> 30. 31. 32. Another phenomenal cover. There you go. Phenomenal. I mean, look at that. He's like on Super Saiyan Torico over here, bro. So good. 33. And then the last pile of Torico. Here we go. 34. I'm going to have to stop putting these on the... Dude, my floor is a mess now. <laughs> 34. 35. 36. 37. 38. 39. 40. 41. 42. And finally, 43 of Tori So that's the whole series of that. Very excited to dive into that. It's going to be a good. Hopefully, well, I did read a few chapters online before I bought it, um, but uh, yeah, uh, we'll go with, uh... okay, i got to reach over and grab this because it's behind another series, yeah, try and get it, okay, here we go, right, so next up we have the Gantz Omnibus. This, I have not read this yet, but I, I like, skimmed through it. This looks weird, man. Like, <laughs> I've heard so many good and bad things about this series, but it looks so weird, man. Like, it is f etchy galore, man. I did not realise it would be that itchy. Like, I know it's explicit content, but I did not realise it was going to be like that. Like... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man, but I've got the first two that are out right now. Uh, I do like the covers and the spines. Um, I wish I had the singles, but, you know, omnibuses will have to do. But, yeah, let me know if you're going to pick that up, because I know a lot of people do like this series, but also a lot of people hate the series. So, I don't know. I guess it's bomb, might You love it or hate it. <laughs> but, yeah, that's Gantz. Um, I'm going to move Torica out of the way again. Yeah, it seems it, man. Like, every... Every, um... What's it called? Uh, like, when they split up a chapter or something like that, it's just, like, tipped in your face, like, every time. It's like, what is going on here? <laughs> I mean, you can't... You don't complain, but it's also, like, too much at the same time, you know? But it is what it is. Ooh, right. Next up, we have a series that I think is underrated. I think... Most people who have read who who have read it uh, do think it's an amazing series, but I don't think a lot of people have, um, and that is Cross Game. Now, Cross Game is a series that I didn't know of um, for a while, but I found out about it like a year or two ago. Um, but yeah, it looks like a good series. I think it's it's obviously baseball, but it's more than just that. It's like a drama. Uh, slice of life type thing so I'm excited to dive into this um, I don't know where to put it <laughs> but yeah there's volume 1 2 I got these quite cheap as well usually they're like I think they were like supposed to be 20 pounds a volume or something like that and I think I got them for like 10 to 8 or something like that but yeah 3 <clears throat> 4 Uh, five, six, seven, and finally volume eight of Cross Game. That's the whole series. I think there's, what is it? Is it I don't know how many volumes there are in total, but yeah, sounds like a good series. I'm excited to check it out, so... Yeah, that's that. Uh, next up, we have two more series left. Yeah, two more series left. Um, one's 25 volumes and one's 20 volumes, and that should be it. I hope I've done the 
uh, adding up correctly by saying 150 plus volumes. Um, but yeah, who knows? <laughs> uh, maybe that's just clickbait. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, next up we have Nura Rise of the Yokai Clan. Now I know apparently this got axed or something like that. I'm not sure if it uh, got put into another magazine and finished there or anything like that. I have no idea. But, yeah, I heard it got axed, but it was still a good series. Um, I did read a couple chapters online. Obviously, I'm rereading it now that I've got the physical releases. Um, but, yeah, I did enjoy what I read, and the art style is really, really good as well. So I'm excited to check out the rest of this series. So, and I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure when you combine the volumes together, they, like, all make one picture or something like that. Um, I don't know what way it's supposed to go. It's like, yeah. Yeah, it does make one big picture when you connect them together. So, obviously, you can see here, like, it kind of connects together, as you can see. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. I think I, you'd have to line them all up in one row, which would just be insane. But, yeah, that's that, I guess. <laughs> There's volume two. Volume three. Volume four. Volume 5, 6, 7, uh, I've got to reach over, 8, lovely cover that one, I do like that one, <clears throat> 9, 10, she's looking crazy. She's not happy. <laughs> 11. 12. Oops. 13. 14. 15. 16. 17. And then last pile of this. Oops, just knocked something. 18. 19. 20. No worries, mate. You missed. I don't know how. I don't know when you when you went. You missed the uh, cross game. So I'll show you. I'll show you one volume. Cross game. There you go. I think you saw my tweet anyway. You missed the Gantz Omnibus, maybe? Um, but yeah, I got both of those new ones. Weird ass series, man. Honestly, I don't, I don't, I don't know, man. <laughs> um, and obviously, you probably missed like some of the Torico ones, but yeah. Um, volume twenty-one of Nura: Rise of the Yokai Clan. <clears throat> volume twenty-two. 23, the covers are sick on this series as well, man, 24, and 25, so that is the final volume of Nura, Rise of the Yokai Clan, and it says, whoops, wrong way, final volume, right there, so, yeah, that is all of that, pretty much, uh, my floor is an absolute mess, honestly, that is crazy, um, also, Nate, I don't know if you saw when I was doing the Neuro Rise of the Yokai Clan stuff, but the uh, covers of this actually like connect together to make like one big picture. I'm not sure if it's all of them that go together, but like the first few, I, tr I tried like five volumes in a row, and they all connected. You see, it makes like one giant picture. So that's pretty cool. It's like the monster volumes with the uh, you know the frames that make one big picture and all that. Uh, it's kind of like that, so that's pretty cool to be honest. I do, I do like that. Um, even though I don't think anyone's going to be stacking it like that in a row, <laughs> but yeah, it's there if you want to do it, I suppose. But uh, yeah, last series have the most, uh, other than Rikudu, these covers have probably the most phenomenal, beautiful covers you will see, and uh, yeah, I, I actually 
don't see this in many people's collection either. Um, but it's a series that looks really good. I mean, the art style is f amazing. And uh, yeah, but that is Tagami Barchi or Barki Bachi. I don't have a Scooby how you say it. I'm just going to say it how I think it's said. But yeah, look at these covers. I mean, just appreciate every single one of these that I show, honestly. They are phenomenal. Volume 2. Right there. Volume 3. Volume 4. Volume 5. Volume 6. Now, I think it's this one. Yeah, this one has like... You can see the glare of the text, but on the other ones you can't. I, I don't think you can see that through the thing. But like even the spine has like a weird texture for the for the text, um, but all the other ones don't. All the other ones are like on the cover. It's really weird. But yeah, there's volume seven, volume eight, one of my favourite ones. But I'll show you my favourite when we get to it. But yeah, there's volume eight, volume. Nine. Uh, I think for, I haven't watched any spoiler reviews. I've watched like non-spoiler reviews. And it's basically like the gist of it is obviously I'm not great at explaining things. But I've heard that it's like uh, these people are I think the sun has gone. And they've had to like create this new sort of sun. So when you're not in the sun, there's like these monsters that you have that like are just roaming around basically, and these people have to like deliver packages to people and fight off these enemies uh, that they come across and things like that. So I, I'm pretty sure that's like the gist of it. It sounds interesting to me, um, but yeah, it, it, the art style is amazing, as I said, and the the covers are phenomenal. Um, but it, it just seems like an interesting series. Um, so yeah. Excited to get into it. Uh, volume 10. Volume 11, which I think is my favourite cover. I, I, I don't know what it is. I just absolutely love it. But yeah, there we go. Volume 12. 13. 14. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and finally, volume 20 right there. So, that... Is everything? Is it a kind of an older series? I think it is. Um, I'm not sure if it says anything, um, but I think it might be. Uh, but yeah, I mean, look look at the size of this these last few volumes compared to like you know, volume 15. I mean, look, I mean the spines look so so good. I mean, look at the spines of that. But look how thick volume 20 is compared to. The rest of them. And not even 19, 18, 17. But the spines are amazing. But yeah. Great stuff. Great stuff there. Um, Tagami Bachi. I think is going to be a good. Good series. Um, I'm going to actually look right now. Real quick. <clears throat> for. There we go. 2006 it started in. And it finished in 2015, it says on my anime list. So, that's pretty much that. Um, but yeah, I mean, there was a lot of volumes, man. That is a lot. Um, but I'm happy to have all of these, man. I've heard such amazing things about all of these series that I've collected here. Um, I am going to go on a, ba uh, a manga ban soon. I'm going to get, I think I'm going to get, like, uh, a couple one-shots. I have ordered a couple one-shots uh, today, 
Um, so they're going to come and I'll probably get them at some point uh, in a couple weeks. But I'm not going to show them off for a while. Um, but yeah, just want to get a couple one shots just to read. Um, nothing too crazy. I'm going to try and go on a ban, as I said, um, for a little bit. So there probably won't be another manga haul for a little bit. Um, but I am going to do try and get some more videos out um, and do things like uh, top 10 manga covers, top 10 manga spines and things like that in my collection and I will get a collection video out soon as well hopefully because I do have a new phone so I can record that now um, so yeah I will do a manga collection video soon, I might even do it tomorrow like record it tomorrow or something like that but uh, yeah I am uh, happy with these pickups man uh, great great stuff um, but yeah expect some more videos soon hopefully as I said top 10 manga covers top 10 manga spines things of that nature um, I'm not going to do reviews of series because I am awful at explaining things and to be honest I just forget half the things that I've read um, I obviously I remember the important things but some of the stuff I just forget uh, so I would not be very good at reviews to be fair but you know we'll see one day I might do a recommendations thing for like 10 series or something like that um but yeah i do definitely want to get some more videos out soon so thanks so much for watching the stream guys hopefully you did all enjoy um christian you can get out my stream adios buddy um but yeah thanks so much for everyone else except christian screw you man um and uh yeah thanks for watching see you all next time peace out <coughs>